Hi there. In the new version of Unity, so the version I'm using right now is 2022. If you go and create a UI text, it's actually going to create a text mesh pro instead of just a plain text component. And in all my previous tutorials, I actually used Unity plain text objects. So I'm going to show how you can use text mesh pro objects instead so that you'll be able to recreate everything else from the previous tutorials. I clicked import TMP essentials to import that text mesh pro. And now let's take a look. So the text is currently right there. So I'm going to move it so it's going to be on screen. And let's go to my camera, switch it to a solid color have something like that. Now in the text game object, I'm going to add a component, a script machine, and I'll just use an embedded. Click edit graph. I'll wait for all the visual scripting initialization to be complete. And after that is done, we get our script graph window. Now previously, all we had to do is just set text. And the very first thing you have is the text component, set text. That component still exists, but that's not the default text UI element that gets created. And instead you need to use text mesh pro. So when we search for set text, you can also see that there's text mesh, then TMP, some other stuff. And also we can find text mesh pro with different options for setting text, but there's two text mesh pros. So this is one of text mesh pro and then there's text mesh pro UGUI. So if you are creating a UI text, then you need to use the text mesh pro UGUI. If you're creating a text mesh pro object in the world, then you would use the text mesh pro instead. Since we did create a UI element, I'm going to use the text mesh pro UGUI. And the version I'm going to use is set text, which looks exactly the same that I used in all my previous tutorials. It just has a string input and just sets the text to it. Now, if you can't find those options in your drop down, I'll show what you need to do in a little bit. But let me finish setting the text here. So let's say hi from VS Visual Scripting and on start, we're just going to change to that text. So if you don't have those uh, nodes that I've just displayed, what you need to do is go to project settings and under visual scripting node libraries. If you scroll down, you need to add unity text mesh pro library with the version that I'm using. The text mesh pro was here by default, so I didn't have to do that. But in case if you don't see those, then you need to look for text mesh pro right there unity text mesh pro and add that after you add it click regenerate nodes and that's going to add those nodes for you but now that everything is connected correctly for us we can click play and see that the text is changing like it did before so i hope you found this video useful thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one